Hello, oh, Vinji. These are some strange days that we're living in right now. If you didn't know, our council has made the decision to lock our building and to suspend worship and all activities until further notice. As you might imagine, this means that we are redefining what it means to be Vinji, as it is now very obvious that the church is not a building. All of that work that we normally do together, um, all of that effort that our congregation spends on our wonderful worship services, our ministries, all of our programs, that's going to need to be redirected now. But it's okay, because we are going to continue to be the church. We're going to continue to love and serve each other and our neighbor. In the Old Testament, God's people were separated from the temple. They were driven out of Jerusalem, and they were dispersed all over in, in strange lands. And many of the books of scripture come from prophets who are trying to help people make sense of how to be God's people, how to be people of faith, God's children through exile and other struggles. God has always been with God's people then, and God is with us today. We don't have to gather in the same physical space to support one another and to be the church. Today, Vinji donated $5,000 to the Candy Ohio County Food Shelf because our work continues together, even though we are in exile. and We are still mindful of the ways that we can serve the vulnerable and those around us. So don't forget to check in on those who are around you. Don't forget to email or call us, your pastors. We're still here to support you. Let us know how we can do that. Don't forget the many ways that you can continue to make a difference in God's world, including donations to organizations like The Food Shelf, Vinji, and other places that you trust that are doing God's work. We need each other now, as we always have. I'll leave you today with words from the prophet, uh, prophet Jeremiah, words that Jeremiah wrote to a people in exile. Keep your voice from weeping and your eyes from tears, for there is reward for your work, says the Lord. They shall come back from the land of the enemy. There is hope for your future, says the Lord. Your children shall come back to their home. One day we will gather again in our building. But until that day, go in peace to love and serve the Lord.